the beginning of this season, uh, you know, we, we talked to the writers and the showrunner and sort of about where our character's going and so forth. And it was my turn to call Scott. And I called him and he goes, so what do you want to know first? And I go, am I getting another motorcycle? <laughs> and he goes, probably. And I go, cool, that's enough for me. Plot-wise, the, the motorcycle comes, uh, we get to a new town and uh, we become friends and uh, they have all this, all these motorcycle parts. So I've sort of, uh, like I've heard it been referred to, uh, I've been a man without a horse for a little bit. So I build a bike. I befriend these guys and build a bike in this new town that we're at. I had nothing else to do. We talked about different ideas and you know maybe a bike that wasn't quite a stock bike. I had gotten a bike from Classified Moto from John and Betsy uh, before this, but you know I was talking to Scott Gimple about it, and he tells me, you know, he told me I'm going to build this bike. So I was like, you know what, I know the perfect guy for this because his bikes have this sort of, you know, for lack of a better word, Frankenstein look to them. It seems like lots of different bikes put together. It's a very unique look of a motorcycle. Now we're building a couple bikes for The Walking Dead. Scott Gimple, who's our showrunner, um, worked really closely with John on every single aspect of the bike. Scott gave me a lot of backstory on it, and we just wanted something that looked utilitarian, like it could go through anything, but it was also, you could tell that, that Daryl put time into it, trying to make it his own. And we've gotten this one all torn down and gotten the, the frame modified. We put a bunch of hooks for like the bags and cut things off and added something for the, the Kickstarter and just all kinds of little brackets and tabs on here. And then we had it powder coated. One of the things that we got was this, uh, this prop crossbow sent to us and we were trying to come up with a real creative way to have this mount to the bike. We made this little rack on the back that's supposed to look kind of cool whether there's a crossbow on it or not. So we tried to put some padding here and then wrapped it in this tape and bleached it and used the heat gun so it looks kind of like this really old tape. But So he'd be coming up after killing some zombies. He'd come up and just snap it into place like that and then he could just ride off. This bike, I think, expresses a lot about really truly what Norman is as a, as a human being and what Daryl is as a character. Let's go see him. Show me stuff. Right. Whoa! <laughs> Those are awesome. This is for the crossbow? It's like the guard. <laughs> Born in the zombie apocalypse. Probably a bad idea. Yeah, let's go ride these. Like right now. <laughs> <laughs>